Welcome to the Springfield Museum of Arts Audio Guide. You are listening to Emily Sullivan Smith introduce her new body of work entitled Universe, which focuses on the global debate between the human and the natural world. My name is Emily Sullivan Smith. I'm an associate professor of art in the Department of Art and Design at University of Dayton. And I'm an artist and activist whose work focuses on the global debate uh, between the human and the natural worlds. So historically, I've gone to, you know, faraway places, the coast of Iceland, the redwoods, um, to just be in landscapes that are really special um, and very particular and peculiar to find inspiration for my work. But during the 2020 lockdown due to COVID, I was really isolated to a very small plot of land in suburban Ohio. That was also a privilege that I was aware of, and I think that's worth noting, that I was safe in my suburban home. Um, a few things happened. I would have the opportunity to watch a spider weave a web, which I wouldn't have had if I was still working. Hearing the birds, not just as a natural cacophony, but as individuals whose homes were also my home. I've always been intrigued by the balance back and forth between human power and interruption of the natural world and the natural world's power and interruption of the human world. There's a lot of back and forth. Humans are often referred to as the most voracious predator that's ever lived on the planet. And that's very impactful to me in terms of how I behave on my small plot of suburban land. I really try in this an eighth of an acre yard to be a habitat for all of the natural species. I plant flowers that are nectar providing. I plant milkweed to bring the butterflies in to really foster that and to undo some of the harm that's been done. There's a lot of Roundup that had been used on the land. It's been a process over, you know, just shy of a decade of sort of healing that tiny plot. So the work is all derived of that. I was uh, focusing on systems of replication. My training is as a printmaker which is a system of replication, and we're able to duplicate over and over. I'm also, you know, steeped in the languages of sculpture, and so broadened my um, knowledge base to casting using rubber molds. 